Hi, welcome to this Arc Linux latest build 18.12.4 and it's now 28th of November. I had a question of a user telling, hey um, Eric, how is this thing working? How to change the color of the Konki RP weather? That's one thing, but how to actually change uh, so that you have the weather information. So in this case, 29 September, I think last year, um, we had this, this um, Konki here. Yeah, 2017. So it is due for a revisit. You see it's still the Arch Merch, one of the first videos ever made for Arch Merch. So it's a good thing to make a uh, take a look at it and, and answer this uh, user. So it's all about Konkis. A Konki. We launched it with Konki Zen. We sort it like this and all this thing is AP, AP, AP and AP points to a person somebody who has donated a conky to us and all these colors are in here and since this is a beautiful orange setting why not go for weather orange or orange red could be as well nice but it sets it each time another conky okay so when we are going to set a conky and change elements because that's what we're gonna do we're gonna change things and if you want to change things and keep the things you changed, right? So AP till AP. Every time you type a skill, all the old information is going to be copied over. Control H. Everything that's hidden, it's all with a dot. Meaning everything is hidden. So Control H shows you all the hidden files. So with the command and that's an alias, scale, I'm gonna copy paste everything over. So I'm gonna copy paste over my conkeys that I create so painfully. So let's assume that this thing is beautiful, that this orange is the one I want. Control C, Control V wouldn't be a bad idea. So when I copy over, I won't overwrite it because nowhere in the world there are gonna be conky named and then maybe use your personal name so you know that's my creation. So rename, first thing. Second thing is it's not in here, not now, cancel. Reload, conky zen, put it alphabetically, go for it, and here you have conky weather orange Eric, and then we're off. So there's a nice little conky and gives us some idea about all the old Alt F2 possibilities and Alt F3 possibilities. And these things are also there for your convenience in Openbox, in i3, and also sometimes in Awesome and in VSPWM, other desktops that we use. So you'll find your fingers, your finger memory, that's what they call it, will find the menu. Okay. Now, how to get this thing here, the weather information? Well, sometimes it's possible to just reload it. So just do nothing, say OK, and there you go. You have this information that comes in. So the first time it tries to communicate to the server, the server is way too slow because the conkey is much faster and did not get any information. So the information for all these icons, if you go into inside the conkey, you'll figure it out. But here it is in your cache. A pretty interesting place to put stuff since when I reboot it's gonna be gone current will be gone the forecast will be gone the weather will be gone so this is where he gets his information city ID name Antwerp coordinations and so on of course I've put my own uh, city in there but you need to change it right so all the information is available the question is where okay you go to your conkey that you changed here, Eric. And if you want to know what AP stands for, it's Ati Pambudi. And that's his Google uh, address. You can follow him there. And you start reading. So a lot of information is coming from him and some from me. And together we're making uh, and some credits as well. You see already four people working, five, six people working for the same conkey. We have some information here on the top, color schemes, icon sources, and that's this, this uh, information that's hidden in Konki. 
this is an API code. So if you want, if you see that this thing is not working anymore, then you should get your own. That's the idea, is that you go to the internet and if you like these, these weather conkeys, personally I'm not quite fond of it because it always breaks because of, well, the fact that this is a, a free service and a free service never stays free forever. So they tend to break. Anyway, you can sign in and sign up and then you get an API key. Get an API key on your account page. Start API for free. And that's what I've done for you guys. I've given my API key to you and it all depends how many hits we get per day. But at some point in time, it won't work anymore because of too many hits, right? If you want to find the city, let's go for that one. Uh, this one, city list, page not found. Let's update this thing. Mm, maps, maybe. No, weather, maybe. Probably here. Uh, block, no, no, no. Allow. City name. Input. Yeah, almost. Antwerp. So help them. It's always going to be uh, some help needed. They will need some help. If you click here, then you'll find the city number. 2803. Let's copy paste. Okay, Antwerp. And indeed, that's the number that says it says here. So let's take another city. Let's go to London. All right? Not that far away. Let's go to London. It's a light rain in London. Fine. And we have a specific number up here. Control C it. Get in here. And do not just delete stuff. Just copy. And like this. I know we still have backups, etc. But I always do it like this, so I quickly can go back to whatever it was. Oh. And then control save, not control Z. So now I want to get an another weather. So let's let's have a look. Let's put this here. Um, the weather forecast should be light rain 13 degrees that's a lot 13 degrees okay so let's see if we can get a new one and let's get the orange eric here okay and uh, let's wait maybe we've done something wrong don't see it coming did we do something wrong template 7 api key Looks all good to me. Let's save it again and try again. All right, seems good. Orange Eric, okay. Let's try another one. Let's see what's going on. Let's type conky. We see as well if that works, okay. Remember the words, oh, well, if you type Control Z, it stays there, KC, KC, right, always kills the conky. So we need to figure out why he's doing the behavior. This behavior is bad behavior, bad boy. So if you take the other one, it's working. Okay, fine. I have my power. I take this one, I take that one, both of them, whether orange, and then compare. Something must be wrong. Okay? So, will he be, let's see if this is bothering him. That's one thing. Okay? And up here, nothing changes. There's only one thing that's blue. Might be the thing. Strange, but I would say you shouldn't look at it at the code, but maybe it does. So, that one is out, that one is in, okay. I'm still in Antwerp, you see? I'm still in Antwerp. So what's the issue? Okay, did I delete something wrong? That's possible. I can do mistakes as well. 
but might be that we still need the cash to get rid of. 262643, so no, that's London. All right, let's clear the cash. We go to Eric, open a new tab. The cash is here. Get rid of the stuff that's in here and then here. All these things are gone. Let's see if we can get the conky to work. Is it still open? I think so. So, orange Eric. Okay, get it back. Here with the forecast. The forecast is coming from London. Fine. And weather Jason is, I don't know, a mist, yeah, probably. Drizzle. Sounds all like London. Here is the word London. So we got new information in. And no sign yet, but that's okay. If we do the conkeys in again, remember it's just too fast. And there you go. We have now late, light, sorry, <laughs> late rain maybe, but light rain in London. These are the temperatures and everything seems to work fine. Now, at some point in time, you'll probably say, Eric, all these shortcut keys, I am part of Eric Linux by now for a year. I know them by heart. What do you do? You just clean it up. You say, okay, let's go down here. Where does it start? Your code is somewhere here. Here it starts with the conky text. So let's put this one here and I do it over like this so I can read. So Alt F2, blah, 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 and classic, classic conky shortcut keys. You see the word here, shortcut keys. Let's keep the word shortcut keys and the horizontal line, the rule, horizontal rule. Let's keep those and save. Then we have this. And instead of shortcut cut keys, let's call it Superman Conky or something, you know, your own personal name. So you still know what it is. Your nickname, I don't know, anything. Superman with a space. There you go. So you have a Conky called Superman with a horizontal rule with space, two spaces. So I'm deleting the two spaces, what happens to the right. Spaces are gone. This is workspace one. This is workspace two. But since there are only two workspaces these days, and we started out with four, decided to get rid of two. So we only see two. Hmm. So you could figure out here as well to delete some of these desktops. Here is desktop three and desktop two. So the question is where does it end and where does it begin? But in essence, it does not uh, hurt us, or it does not uh, give us any problem, all right? But it's some trial and error. If match desktop is four, so I'm guessing that this code is for desktop four, save. Never read this code, just have to experiment a little bit. And here it says again, if match three, then give it color. And now we have only two left. Okay, a bit awkward. So let's go to, I don't know, let's see what 200 is. It's more in the middle, but I guess 180 would be better. And that's how you start changing and moving things. 180 is more or less, I think, in the middle. Let's make this like so. It's not in the middle at all. Then maybe 50 is good. You can also take a look at the width of this thing to figure out and the height 700 width 200 but we took 100 so there's no really guarantee that these numbers will will be the half of the width i don't even think that we're in the middle as of yet so you keep experimenting and keep changing numbers unless you say visually yep that's the middle now something changed here Something desperately changed here with the font. So I deleted something in here, Control Z somewhere. Uh, what was it again? Control Y. So we went for 140. Control Z, Control Z, Control Z, Control Z. Keep it always open. Here it is. This font should not go. So everything. 
till here should go, but not the font. Font is back. Now my height is, is way too, um, too long. So the height can be changed as well to, well, to control, I see it already, but if you control find and then height, you can uh, find it easily. 700 is this, how about 600, save. Ah, much better. And why not put it in the middle or put it more to the top as well. So the Y axis, if you put it to zero, what happens? I always try extremes. How about 10? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But then the other are also 10, 10, 10. X and Y, that's a good idea. Or you can say all together, let's put it in the middle. So you have top right, it's not explained in here. So we're going to look at the code somewhere else in the AOR Arco Linux com key. It there's more explanations here. Top left, top left, top middle. What I want is not bottom middle either. I want middle to the right. That's a possibility as well, middle right. How about instead of top right, I put it to the middle in the right, which is that thing, middle right. Well, I like more the top, but that's personal. So let's leave that. How about coloring? You could change, we have a few colors uh, in there. Uh, you could change the color a little bit. Um, Take this maybe in a general white, why not? Something like that. So you take a look at the color scheme. This FFF thing is, is white, which is color two. So if I can find the bars and tell them to be color, uh, what was it? Color two, then we'll have white bars. So scrolling, 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 system info. Found it, system info. So where was it again? Here. That's the horizontal rule. And here we have CPU. That's that line, 40% CPU. And then we have mem percentage. That's too far. Here's the CPU bar. It says color zero. I say color two, was it? I think, right? Save. And we have a white one. So I'm gonna continue my strange changes here i think it will be nice two and two or we can just keep one in the middle yellow or the other one yellow red green i don't know whatever color you know choose whatever you want um, maybe you want to change something uh, for other uh, other elements the only thing you need to do i think is just put them side by side and look for the words system info is here so align center, that's what it does, align C, and you learn by um, reading code and say, okay, that's line, align to the right, give color one with font, pixel size 12. Hmm, 12 pixel size. Bigger, smaller, you can change these things. Another font, anything is possible. You see all the information, RAM is here, uptime, and so on. Okay, I think that um, is another tutorial about conkeys and that will replace the one that is on the website. Where are your website? So we'll copy paste this one in here and put that one down. So this is another tutorial to understand how conkeys work. All right, cheers.